Welcome back to Good Day Columbia and happy St. Patrick's Day to you. It's a Food Friday. We're out here at Moriarty's Pub. All of this, of course, sponsored by U.S. Food Chef Store. So Devin has been knocking it out of the park in the kitchen. And Devin, now we're talking not your basic burger. This is a smuggler burger. This is our smuggler burger. Okay, what's the name? Um, it's just something unique. You know, we wanted people to remember the burger. Yeah. Uh, and, you know, any anybody can call it a burger with cheese and, you know, salsa on top of it. But with all the things you do behind the scenes kind of smuggles in flavor, if you will. Very much so. Oh, <laughs> you didn't even laugh at me. I'm, you did good. You did good. Okay. So, um, where do you start with this one? Uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to take our own proprietary blend of burger meat. It has chuck and short rib in it. It has a lot of moisture, uh, real good, rich flavor to it. And we're going to take some of our house seasoning. Sprinkle that on top there, and then we are going to throw this on the grill. So of course, then you cook it to whatever the customer requests. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite? What do you do? Medium rare. Oh, okay, okay. So you get it to medium rare, mm -hmm. um, and then what do you do? Well, uh, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our brioche bun, mm -hmm. we're going to throw it on the flat top, and we're going to grill both sides. Okay. And then after that, um, as soon as we flip the burger, we make our own fresh uh, honey jalapeno sauce, and this has fresh roasted uh, jalapenos, a little of our tomatillo poblano salsa and uh, grade A honey, and we coat the uh, burger in this. Oh, yum. Got a sweet little kick to it, huh? And then we got toppings here. Yep, well, right after that, we're gonna throw our fresh Swiss cheese on top of that, and it's gonna melt on top of the, the honey jalapeno is gonna candy a little bit, give it a little extra flavor, oh, and then okay. the melted cheese on top of that. And then our final topping is our uh, tomatillo poblano salsa. We make that fresh uh, from scratch with fresh tomatillos. What's a tomatillo? Uh, it's, ba it's, a sm it's a small green tomato, but it's not your traditional green tomato. It has a nice citrus flavor to it. Not quite as juicy. No. Okay, so, uh, so what else is in there, tomatillo? Um, we had fresh poblanos, uh -huh. uh, fresh roasted garlic. It has thyme, cumin, our house seasoning, um, fresh sage uh, for a little earthy taste. And then um, we add uh, some jalapeno juice and fresh squeezed lime. This isn't just your typical lettuce, tomato, pickle. This is kind of special. Uh, this is very special, uh, and this is the reason we actually don't just serve our burgers with our lettuce, tomato, pickles, and onions on top. Yeah. We serve that on the side because we are also proud of that, and we want to advertise that to the customer as well. Okay, so what's so special about this? Well, it, it starts with fresh romaine lettuce and fresh uh, sliced tomatoes, and then we make our own pickles with the sriracha white wine vinegar that I've been talking so much about. <laughs> Um, with fresh sliced cucumbers, sit for a couple days in that, uh, in refrigeration. So they take on the flavor of that, and, and uh, it it's, has a little bit of the flavor of a pickle, but it still has the fresh the crispness freshness of, of cucumber. Exactly. And I like cucumber. And then um, it, everybody is either 100% yes or no on onions. <laughs> so I wanted to do something a little different with it to, you know, spice it up. So we take the same pickling, uh, the same um, white wine vinegar juice, and we actually make our own lager drenched red onions. Yeah, okay. So it still has a little bit of the flavor of the onion, um, but it has it adds a little more to it and it complements everything else on the burger. So we're gonna set this on the side next to the burger. Okay. And serve it up with our house fries. And chow down, and that's exactly <laughs> what I'll be doing at 835. Stay with us, you guys. More good day coming up.